Join me, Karen Martini, to uncover the provenance of our most loved wine regions. Each week you'll hear from local chefs and Jacobs Creek winemakers, bringing great food and wine together. Welcome to the Reserve Table. We're here in the beautiful Adelaide Hills where Jacobs Creek makes its reserve Pinot Noir. And it's great to be here with our very own Jacobs Creek grape grower, Sam Vergara. Your job is to create the perfect food and wine match in an exciting challenge that showcases your provenance. Jacobs Creek Reserve Pinot Noir is spicy, aromatic and delicately savoury with sour cherry and cedar oak flavours. So think about that when you create your dish. Generally with a Pinot, you'd be looking at duck or venison. Personally, I'd go for a venison with this. I'm going to go with goat curd with this. I know that's not what other chefs would do, but I'm going to take a risk with it. Hey! I've been buying cheese from Saul for years now. It's such an amazing product. This is some of our local goat's curd. They're fresh goat curd. It is an elegant, light, delicious cheese that will match perfectly with the wine. After tasting that Pinot this morning, I thought, OK, Got to get some venison. The pinot that you selected is a match made for venison. This is the piece that we're after right here. Got a really unusual cut from the knuckle. I think it's going to work really well. Oh, that is so tender. This afternoon is going to be good fun, good healthy competition, and a good celebration of some of the produce coming out of the region. looking like a very interesting challenge because you've got Andy who's doing quite a purist type dish. He's got the venison clean on the plate and then a fresh vibrant salad of raw beetroot which I wasn't quite expecting. And then you've got Sylvia who's doing a composed fresh style dish. She's got some beautiful local ingredients. I'm just wondering how she's going to bring them all together. It'll definitely tell the story of local provenance but I'm hoping that it stands up to the Pinot as well. So here we are. What I've made for you today is some stuffed pine mushrooms and a lovely salad of wild edibles, 100% from the local area, and I think it's going to go beautifully with Jacob's Creek Reserve Pinot Noir. Here's your venison and some local veggies from out here. You've got some beetroot, cabbage, red onion. This pretty well sums up my take on the provenance. Hey, guys. Hi. Today your challenge was to match the Jacobs Creek Reserve Pinot Noir and showcase your provenance. You guys definitely did that. But for us, the venison dish, Andy just turned the corner and pipped you, Sylvia, but oh, both amazing dishes. Really well. <laughs> That's absolutely fun. Andy was the deserved winner with his venison. It was a perfect match to the Jacobs Creek Reserve Pinot Noir.